Hello very good day and welcome. Today we will talk about the intensive and extensive properties of matter. The attributes or qualities of substances are known as properties. These properties can be classified into two groups, intensive properties and extensive properties. Among the properties of substances there are some that can be appreciated through the senses, such as color, flavor, touch, sensation, etc., which are called organoleptic characters. Organoleptic characters and physical constants are called intensive or specific properties. These properties do not depend on the mass available, since for the same substance they are the same, both in a small portion and in a larger quantity. Some examples of intensive properties are elasticity, speed, specific volume, density, boiling point, melting point, viscosity, among others. If you have a liter of water, its boiling point is 100 degrees Celsius considering that it is at a pressure atmosphere. If another liter of water is added, the new system, consisting of two liters of water, has the same boiling point as the original system. This illustrates the non-additivity of intensive properties. On the contrary, the extensive properties depend on the mass that is available, as is the case of the volume. Weight surface, etc. For example, when we talk about the volume of a body, we will see that it varies depending on whether it has more or less mass. Two liters of water will have more mass than half a liter and therefore more volume. If we compare two objects of the same thickness but of different lengths like two pencils, we will know that the longest will have more mass. Extensive properties are additive because the same extensive property values can be added together. In general, the quotient between two extensive magnitudes gives us an intensive magnitude. For example, from the division between mass and volume the density is obtained. This is how we quickly learn what are the intensive and extensive properties and the differences that exist between them. See you in the next video. Muchas gracias por ver el video, dale like, comparte con tus amigos y nos vemos el próximo video.